So I wanted to do a short video to give my opinion on the carnivore diet, okay? Where you're just eating meats mainly. Um, here's my thoughts. It's good for certain types of cases, people that have GI issues, people that have a lot of uh, chemical sensitivities, um, because it can help them. And I think that would be good short term as they're healing. But if they do that, I'm gonna highly recommend that they add organ meats because with organ meats, you can get all the fat soluble vitamins, there's more minerals. And US Wellness Meats is a really good source of like liverwurst, like grass fed, and they even have some burgers that have organ meats mixed in there. So I really think that would be really good. But a diet that provides all the nutrients is really the best diet that you can be on. So you can choose different types of foods, but it's gonna be really hard to get all of your nutrients just from this diet. Uh, vitamin C is gonna be missing, uh, certain minerals, potassium is probably gonna be low. So that's why I like a combination of animal proteins and vegetables. I think that would be even better than this. But on the flip side, some people with digestive issues do very well on this diet. Personally, I've tested out um, consuming large quantities of vegetables on myself and tens of thousands of other people for a long period of time, and I know that works very well. Also, you get the phytonutrients, but if you're doing this diet, you're not gonna get a lot of phytonutrients, which has a lot of health benefits. And another challenge is if you're doing this, you're gonna basically be doing a high protein diet, okay? And the type of keto that I recommend is moderate protein. So if you're doing large quantities of meat, for example, um, you're gonna spike insulin to some degree. You're also gonna get a lot of phosphorus. You're gonna get a lot of nitrogen. Uh, if the kidneys can't handle it, if the liver uh, is not healthy, that could also be a problem with the buildup of ammonia and the vegetables could counter that very easily. So I think it's good in certain circumstances temporarily, but generally not for everyone. All right, why don't you comment below and tell me what you think. So we've been getting a lot of success stories, but I don't have your success story yet. So click the link down below and upload your before and after. I wanna actually hear about your success story. I wanna see your before and afters. And every week we do featured success stories. So. Click the link down below and share your success.